much you guys got another video here for you this one is called the cry ransomware and uh, it's pretty nasty it will encrypt all your data but I want to show you the process uh, uh, someone said to me the other day was what how do they get the money out of you how do they take payment without being caught so I thought I'd show you this part as well in this video so this one's not just how it encrypts your data but it's more about uh, the process they go through to get money from you uh, safely without getting caught so let's take a look so this is the cry ransomware so I'm just going to quickly open up here I've got my process explorer running I'm going to click on this and you will see the file start to run here now once that starts to run this will change as you'll see in a second the file has not encrypted my data as of yet so I can just pull this to one side you can see yes to the user account control and now the file has changed and what we'll do here is open up this and I'll quickly put this to one side and I'll put this to one side and you can see what happens now this is obviously going to start to encrypt my data. This is probably in the temp folder and we can take a look at that right now. I'll just quickly go to this location. You can see the file here and if I right click on this we can open up in file location and you can see it is in a temp folder in the app data local temp. So what we'll do is we'll just leave this running here and uh, eventually it will encrypt all your data and then we can look at the process of what they do to try and get money from you. Now I wouldn't advise that you ever pay for these uh, these cyber criminals to get your data back once the data's gone. If there isn't a decryption tool available then I'd advise you to just uh, reformat your system and uh, put your windows back on and that is it. I would not advise you to pay these people any money uh, to get your data back because you're never guaranteed to get your data back even if you do pay them. Let's remember that they are criminals and that's what they're doing. So we'll just leave this as is at the moment and uh, we'll see what happens once this uh, encrypts your data. And there we have it. That's now encrypted all your data as you can see there all that data has been encrypted and you can see it says dot cry that's the actual extension that it puts on all your data and renaming these files will not get your data back as you can see it's encrypted so now once that's done the process will stop and it will drop these files on your system so these files are how you get your recovery so let me just show you this file here you can see at the top it says warning your documents databases project files audio video content and other critical files have been encrypted with uh, a military grade uh, crypto algorithm and you can see here it's 4096 bit RSA and you can see what they're saying here if you have really valuable data you better not waste your time because there's no other way to get your files except make a payment so they're trying to goad you into paying you can see here they've given you a big large key this key will change it for every person that gets infected with this and then they also want you to go to one of these websites to pay for your data back okay and we'll take a look at that in a second uh, but first if you come all the way down um, here it does say here now also it says if for some reason the site cannot be opened to check your internet connection and it also says unfortunately these sites are short term since the antivirus companies are interested in you do not have the chance to restore your files but continue to buy their products uh, unlike them we are ready to help you always well they're the ones that have actually encrypted your data so they are not here to help you they're here to scam you out of your money so what we need to do now is install the browser 
there it is so you can see here they're asking you to get this step and we can right click and go to that place and they'll ask you to download the tool browser now that's how they're hiding themselves they are hiding themselves through tool and we're going to install this and once that's installed it'll ask you to connect to that browser and that's how they're hiding and they're probably asking for payment through Bitcoin or something like that which is even harder to trace so now we're running this here so we're just gonna open this up and we're gonna connect and you can see it connecting now as you can see we can now close this one off and you can test your network settings and you can see congratulations the browser is configured to use Tor and basically what they're doing you can see what it's doing here the Tor uh, circuit for this site the browser Netherlands Hungary Finland and you can see how hard that is to uh, track these people down so the next thing they want you to do is to get their actual link now you can use any one of these free and then what they want you to do is go back to here and paste that into here now you can see this is struggling to connect and that's maybe because the antivirus company have killed these links off and that's what they do and then you won't be able to get your data back unless there is a decryption tool available to you so we're just gonna continue to let this connect if it can and if that one doesn't work there is uh, other ones here you can try there's three of them here and that is basically it they just want you to go in here try and do this and what this will do is what this will open up a private window and then they would ask you to input your personal ID code this thing here and then it will ask for payment and then they will send you a code to decrypt all your files I would not advise you to do this they are criminals and they will scam you so this is what the uh, whole the whole process is is about scamming you out of your money uh, your files weren't encrypted in the beginning and uh, now they're asking you for payment to decrypt your files so I would not uh, give them any money at all you can see here there is no response to this uh, link here and that's because it's been probably taken down um, either by the antivirus companies or by whoever it is by the cyber criminals who knows so if that was the case and you can't get it maybe the server is down it says here the server is down temporary uh, it may be out of action so that means you won't be able to get your data decrypted uh, by that method so this is just the process of how they get the money out of you um, to show you how they uh, try to lure you in and try and make you pay for your uh, decryption keys I wouldn't advise you to do it as I've always said uh, just leave it well alone if you've lost your data then you've lost your data you're going to have to live with that personally I would not pay uh, a person to decrypt my files and there is no guarantee that you would get your data back anyway even if you uh, did uh, pay for the uh, decryption now there might be other methods we can use uh, to try and get data back data recovery and stuff like that there might be other methods that you can try to recover your data but that's for another video anyway anyway I'm going to wrap this one up my name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk if you enjoy these videos guys then hit the like button also hit the subscribe button if you want to keep up to date when I upload new videos also, if you've got any video requests or any problems with your computers, head over to the forum. That's the place to be. And if you haven't joined my Facebook fan page, pop over there and give us a little like up over there as well. Anyway, thanks again for watching. Thanks for your continued support. Bye for now.